Alberta has the third largest oil reserve in the world. Most of this oil is trapped within a mixture of sand and water. These mixtures are known as oil sands. Oil sands deposits that are within 75 meters of the ground surface can be extracted through surface mining. Surface mineable oil is an important source of energy in Alberta. However, extracting it results in process waste streams. For every volume of surface mineable oil that is extracted, 12 volumes of process waste are generated. These process waste streams consist of water, sand, fines, and residual oil. Residual oil is oil that has been left behind in these waste streams. This oil is a valuable resource. However, there are currently no effective methods of recovering it. But what if we could recover the unrecoverable? What if we could find benefit in a waste stream? My research project involves developing an environmentally friendly technology to recover the oil that has been left behind in these waste streams. This technology is known as supercritical fluid extraction. A supercritical fluid is a fluid that has been pressurized so that it acts like both a liquid and a gas. Like liquids, supercritical fluids are excellent at dissolving compounds. And like gases, they can diffuse into tight spaces. These properties are beneficial because it means we can use a supercritical fluid to extract specific compounds from a mixture. For example, supercritical fluid extraction is commonly used for extracting the caffeine out of coffee and tea. The focus of my research is developing the use of supercritical fluid extraction to recover residual oil from oil sands waste streams. My research uses carbon dioxide, or CO2, as a supercritical fluid. To begin the extraction process, the CO2 is pressurized to about 200 times the pressure in this room and is mixed with the oil sands waste stream. As they are mixed together, the residual oil dissolves into the supercritical CO2, successfully separating it from the rest of the waste stream. This new mixture of CO2 and residual oil is then depressurized, causing the CO2 to return to a gaseous state. Now, because the CO2 is no longer supercritical, it can no longer dissolve the residual oil. And so the oil falls out of the CO2. The CO2 can then be recycled and reused in the process, and the residual oil is a valuable resource that can now be utilized. The picture I have behind me is a vial containing a sample of the oil that I've recovered. Residual oil is a potentially significant source of energy that currently remains unrecovered in oil sands waste streams. Supercritical fluid extraction is an innovative approach to recovering this oil. Using supercritical fluid extraction, we can benefit from a waste stream by recovering a valuable resource that would have otherwise been lost. Thank you.